<laughs> that was the last one was like, do it. I want you to. All right, y'all. I'm back. And I hope it's better. That was Cricket. She says hi. Better. Bueno. So. So if I go to Sprint and say, hey, I don't want to have you guys anymore, I could go to. You could take your number and go to AT&T. Because I'm no, under no contract with Sprint. Right. Evening, everyone. Give me a, I need a new phone anyway. Right. You did your first pour today. That's amazing. I want to see it. I can't look up at the wall and give you hashtags and all the things, but you know. <laughs> you know all the things. Jeff can come over and paint my wall. Right. Artist till death right up there. Yeah. Ta-da. Just started and we're at 54 people. Awesome. That's amazing. What are you going to do? Afternoon Angel Heart, cool venue. It is a cool venue. This is Judy's pad. I will ask Judy if she wants to be on. I'm not gonna force someone to show up on film. I'll take a short introduction and then I'm through. Okay, <laughs> tell me when you're ready. Whatever. All right, y'all, this is a lovely Miss Judy. She's amazing. No, we're not in the shed. The shed is out there, but it has, like, you can't see it, but it's right there. It has no light yet. Yeah, it has no light yet. So we're working in the kitchen. We just moved all of, nope, most of our paint out to the shed. We still have a little bit to go, but I didn't. I need the resin. Um, are we going to have little cups or we have no little? Yeah, we have little cups. We have, we have a very little cup and we have these little cups so you want to use these little cups everyone so happy to meet you miss judy well i'm glad to meet everybody now it's time i'll watch y'all chat too <laughs> <laughs> it's weird i've been waiting all night for you guys well sorry we're late y'all we were we're setting up an art palace okay Cujo. Shh. Cujo, that's enough. Be quiet. Be quiet. Cricket. It's nice to put a face with the name. Six, twelve. Um, start with six. Um, so because we have this one. So the backup. It'll be twelve. Okay. I like the workspace. Doesn't she have a beautiful kitchen? It's the Jeff and Erica show with special guest star, Miss Judy. <laughs> this is true. Y'all, we've been doing all the things all day. I've been packaging stir sticks to hopefully send out tomorrow. I haven't answered email yet. So if you hashtagged us or send me an email, I'm not ignoring anybody. I'll get, I promise I'll get to it all tomorrow. Judy's the red boss. This is true. For Queen Judy at Palace, I agree. Ellen I Mack had a cricket. Empress, thank you. Oh, Empress thank you. Judy. You guys have to get it right. The infamous Miss Judy. It's good to see her face. This is true. She's infamous. So today we are gonna pour on some these. I think Judy got these from Blick. Yes. They're just regular, not prep cradle boards. So we prepped them with that bullseye. Well, I want to. I want to see what it looks like raw. Hopefully, there won't be like. I don't know because I want to use the inks. So that it'll, when you do touches it, it'll stain it. Right. I think it'll look neat. I think so, too. Hopefully, we don't get air bubbles. 
guest spot with Empress Judy. This is so true. Thank you, Shy. Hey, Karen. I agree, Miss Judy is awesome. Clara, we do have royalty in the house. We need a little trumpet sounds. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I'm the timekeeper. The timekeeper. Mm -hmm. I'm keeping time in stir. Gotcha. <clears throat> the resin tour. If you weren't there, you're dried out. I like it, Kelly. Well said, sir. Hey, Molly. You want to get my stir stick? Oh, yeah, we do. My artist stick. Yeah, that would be awesome. Yeah. A little easier with that. Yeah. Hey, Ticey. Yeah, these are very funny. So, what colors are you working with? These, these are so cool. The silicone? We're going to see how Judy's silicone cups work. They're super cute. Where do you get them from? Amazon. Amazon. The colors he's using. Thank you, ma'am. <coughs> we brought Judy some sticks. Sticks? He's using something. Artisu Electric Blue. Sky Blue. I almost spilled a beer. Fantasy Blue. Ooh, metal flakes. Nice. And then shimmering bronze copper. What's up, Kelly? How do you clean out your measuring cups if you reuse them? If you are talking about these kind of cups, we just leave whatever we use to stir it against the side. And then once it's set, you can pull the stick out and it will pull, if you mixed right, everything out with it. If you didn't mix thoroughly, you're going to leave bits behind. So that's a good way to check and see if you're mixing everything the right way. These, I believe you can just turn inside out and then just so pop everything out and reuse. <laughs> These are silicone. I'll take a three minutes, sir. Okay. Margaret said, I asked my family for input on. Hey, Cujo. No. Sorry, y'all. We have three alarm systems in the house tonight. The other two are in the living room. So Margaret said they decided on my name and wanted to know if AOB Creations is good, artist on a budget. I like AOB. Cujo, stop barking. How do you keep the dust off the silicone? That is something I will have to ask Miss Judy because she uses these. This is the first time we'll be using these. Does that keep the dust off and everything? Yeah, you just rinse them with water and go have a pet cat. Oh, she says they don't collect dust, which is awesome. Clara says the OXO silicone cups I'm not happy with. Do you know the brand of your silicone cups? Siliconies. I'm not making that up. I bought them on Amazon. They're called bathroom cups. They come four dollar package. Bathroom cups. On here it says siliconies, so it's probably siliconies bathroom cups. They're awesome. They come in four to a pack. I think they're seven dollars. Oh, that's awesome. Sorry we're late, y'all. Well, it's not like we tell them. 
Oh, no, they're just saying I thought I'd missed it because I tuned in and you weren't on. Love the colors. Hello from San Diego. That's awesome. Welcome, Tiger Mouse. Thank you. Rachel or Rochelle? I've been watching for you guys, so glad I checked back. Thanks, Nancy. Greg said he almost nailed his thumb to one of the cradles he built today. <laughs> what does that sound like? Kelly Green asks, how do you fix a scorch? I made a boo-boo today. All you can do is wait for it to set and then do a flood coat. My boss then started to chime in with the barks. Your dog barks and my pug barks back. That's funny. I don't know if I like these cut, like, because they're so squishy. I feel like I'm gonna. <laughs> like, we can't Put really them together, they get a little more stability. Crazy Daisy Lou asks What is something you know now that you didn't know when you started that you wish you had known then? That's a good question. Do you have an answer? Uh, no. Hmm. No, I knew it all to begin with because I did a lot of research. Right? What, do we have wipes? Did you say you have alcohol wipes? Yes, I do have wipes. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I also have the, the pump. Oh, yeah. That stuff. I think something that we wish we'd have known when we first started that we didn't is that whether you're scared of the product or not, it's, it's going to turn out the same either way. It's a wipe that has alcohol in it, so. But I have pure alcohol if you want to wet it down with some just alcohol. There you go. So basically, it doesn't matter if you're scared of it or not. It's, it's going to do what it's going to do anyway. So there's no sense in, like, I'm not ready to try it. I wish I had known how much more space that I need than I had. How much space it takes? Yeah. Yeah, definitely takes more space than it looks like it would. I also wish I'd known not to waste money on paints that aren't going to do anything for the artwork. Like, cheap, cheaper paints. Just doesn't look good in resin. It's chunky. It's not cute. What's something else? What do you have? What else? I don't know. I will let you know as soon as I think of what else. But that's a great question. And now I don't know where I'm at. Welcome, Candy. Tim loves the Kiss shirt. Was on stage with them last September. Awesome. That's bananas. You don't like those cups. I have other cups. Oh, this, have to nice. this is fine. This sounds fine. Hey, Ron. Ron, we got your gift today. You rock. Thank you very much. Ron sent us some resin, and it's awesome because you can't have too much too resin. Much. Yeah. Megan said, I've been watching Pewdie, PewDiePie. PewDiePie. Do you know that's the number one watched person? PewDiePie? PewDiePie. What is that? It's some girl, and she's... People weren't sure if she was like, like a real animation type person or if she's a real person. She's very mysterious. She has like long videos where she just repeats her name like for 20 minutes. Oh my gosh. Is she like a performance artist or something? I think she's just a person that was interesting enough to where a lot of people wanted to know what's up. And so she has a lot of views. I don't know. I've never watched her. I've just heard about it. Hey, Karen. Do I sand it? What's a flood coat? Um, for if you've scorched a piece, I would sand it because you're going to be putting resin over the whole piece, not just a spot fix. So sand it with a 220 or 400 
wipe it down with alcohol, and then do a clear coat that covers the whole thing. That's a flood coat. Oh, I'm confusing PewDiePie with Poppy. That's right. Now, what is PewDiePie then? What? Do I, I don't know. Pineapple Rita, sippy sippy. Can't pass that up. Cheers. Claudia's in Costa Rica on a vacation. Jealous. Judy, you have it all. <laughs> she has every color ever made. You should see what we took out to her. She shed. Judy's poor house. You don't get it because you're with poor house. <laughs> <laughs> nice drying trays, right? She has cake pans on rollers for drying, which is brilliant. It has a, plastic, it has a cover that goes over it, too, if you want to close it all up. Well, that's just super genius. Like you put a whole thing over it? It has its own little zipper cover that goes over it. They also make them twice that tall. Yeah. I watch Cupcake Wars every now and again. <laughs> Tandy says, you talked about doing a live auction but didn't know how. Watch Mining America. He does one-minute live auctions for rocks, and it goes very well. Just a thought. That's not a bad idea. Never enough space. Aw, oh, thank you for the gift to start the evening off. Ordered alcohol wipes after watching Susanna. What's up, Jan? Hey, Fran. Ideal room temp for resin humidity a factor. You want to be between 70 and 75 dry. Humidity will make the resin not set up as quickly and if it's too humid, too, too humid, it'll make it cloudy, I've heard. I've never seen it done. Oh, PewDiePie is a guy. See? <laughs> it's a gamer. And I was thinking Poppy. My bad, everybody. <laughs> I watched this guy, his, his name is Mr. Beast, and he, he's kind of a, he's obviously super nice, super generous, um, he kind of nerdy, um, real smart, but he gives people like $30,000. Like he, he'll, he'll say, first person to comment this, a uh, $1,000, and he'll give it to you right then. Like he gives these like streamers uh, $10,000, $20,000, like how do you, like I, I don't I don't is understand it, how he is it real? Yeah. I mean he's in and, and, and he films it while they give it to him when he gives it to him and their reaction is just like it's I don't know. Now wait a minute. Yeah, how, how does he film their reaction and then are they with him? No, I think it's just on the computer. Like I think he can record oh. whatever he's watching. So it's like a Skype thing or something. I think so. It's like a side by side or yeah. I think when you do those gaming things, you can do a side-by-side -side view of people. Ron said, I would have sent more, but it's all I could afford. That was completely beyond generous, and we appreciate it. I think I'm going to put a color in this. It will not go to waste. Oh, absolutely not. Jill said, I tried to watch those Rio people last night. Gun emoji and two hammers. Kill me. I couldn't do it. <laughs> what? Oh. I'm not even going to say my feelings. Everybody has their niche, and they have more subscribers than I do, so. I, I, I've been at it longer than you have. Give me a minute. Give me a month. Not really. I think they have in, like, the six, 60,000 followers, something like that. Yeah, Shy, I don't know gamers. My little sister would kick me in the shin if I messed that up, I'm sure. He makes fun of stuff now. I didn't know that. Ellen says, Jeff, you're quiet. I'm just mixing, sorry. <laughs> just mixing He's a little it. overloaded with color options tonight. Yeah. And then you can tell I'm using five colors. <laughs> 
And we're using our trusty, handy dandy Artist Tell Death stir sticks. You guys go to artistelldeath.com and purchase some. Two T's, two L's. I can't. Two T's, two L's. Rod said he gave us a tip and said gift on the way from England addressed to Jeff Erica. <laughs> <laughs> It'll get to me. Somebody calls us Jeffrica. I think that's Jojo. She has the Corgi profile yeah. picture. Well, it's not bad. It was not. You had, what was it? Ben, Benifer? Mm-hmm, right. It's better than that one. Amazing colors, Judy has. Great idea, I have the same thing for drawing. We're gonna do something like that one day. Hey, Erica and all. Hey, Fran. The sparkle looks bananas. It does. <gasps> Y'all, look at that. And I mixed, um, it's, it's this. Can I look through here? Oh, <gasps> I can. <laughs> We're gonna need one. And then that way I can see too. <laughs> uh, this is a red velvet that I put in that to make it look like that. Looks good. All right. What is the rack called? It's a bun. B U N pan. It's it's. You, I got it on Amazon, and you buy it and the the full. You want full sheet cake pans. That's what it is. It goes to the floor with racks. That one, right. that one's ten. Racks on racks on racks. Hey ideas. Hey Susanna. Better late than not at all. Barbara, we just got here 20 minutes ago. What did Ron send? He sent us 32 ounces of art resin, which is awesome. We more than I could just have purchased. Yeah. A lot. A lot. All right. Just do what I know. It's going to be beautiful no matter what you do. Who are the Rio people? It's just another channel. Hi, Jeffrica and Judy. It's Jojo. Hi, Jojo. Finally made it to another live. Hello, ATD fam. And poor people. I've watched many of your videos and I've heard Judy's name before, but I don't know who she is and how you know her, etc. We, she just started watching our videos one day and we became friends online. And last month we came out to visit and deliver a painting that she had commissioned and we talk every day now. And she invited us over for dinner and we helped her move into her pouring house and- Put tables together. We put tables together and we just like, we just love hanging out with her and her her children, her fur babies. There's one in here. The other one's in the other room. She's basically one of our very best friends and fairy godmother. Aww. When you look up the word annoying, say Rio pop up. Y'all, we gotta be sweet. <laughs> Why are they so popular? I mean, everybody likes different things, and I've watched their work, and it's good work. That pink ring is amazing. Rick said, Rio's so obnoxious, but she can mix color like a pro. Jeff is talking really low. Try a shotgun mic from eBay. Love your art. Jeff. Thanks. You basically whispered that right after he was like, he speaks really low. <laughs> Thank you, Samantha. Hey, Sue. You didn't miss much. I just showed people around Judy's house, well, her kitchen, which is gorgeous. And now we are pouring. This is the first piece.
Greg, that's too funny. That is like not what I'm wanting to do with this. That is a real, that heat gun like really heats up fast. Can't wait to see what the fire painting turned out like. It actually turned out really great. Hey, Judy, hoping to get my artist suit soon. Um, she has to wait till she gets shipments from. Is she the one that has the order in? Jerry and Jody Granger. Uh, I don't remember. There were a bunch, so I'm sorry if I don't remember. She's Is it on this order. No idea. I've got an order coming in, so. Yeah, she's waiting on her shipment from Sue who is dealing with family issues right now. All gifts are beautiful, this is true. How do you two feel pouring outside of your studio? Um, it, it's fine to me, I mean, it's just. The same process. Yeah. We're just using GD stuff. If we were pouring with someone that wasn't as prepared as Judy is for doing this yeah. type of artwork, it would be stressful, but Judy is prepared for whatever art. She has all the things for all the arts. So it's super easy. Hey, Becky. Oh, Rio has 34,000 subs. She's amazing at creating colors. This is true. Like, she's... She does know her colors. She knows colors really well. That being said, begging for expensive gifts is off-putting. I could see that. That's why I don't watch it anymore. I want a pouring house. Y'all, when she gets it, she's getting the, she had the electrician here this week. It's almost time to move her all the way into it. She just needs the AC put in. It's almost done. I need to hear Jeff laugh. It makes me happy. <laughs> He'll do it. These look a real lot like auburn colors. <sighs> it's hurting my Alabama soul. They're always asking for stuff. I can't stand it. It's, it gives me anxiety. I used countertop epoxy today and mixed with a drill, but it didn't turn clear. Did I do something wrong? It's thick also. It is very thick. Sometimes you have to thin it by putting the jugs in um, a warm water bath. Also, since you used a drill mixer to mix it, the reason why it wasn't clear is because it's bubbles getting mixed in. A lot of bubbles put together will make it look cloudy, but as soon as you put heat on it, it should have cleared up. So it should be fine. I think I just made the colors too light. Hi from Minnesota. Hey, Kim. I used to have a hotel in Minnesota, but you probably have never heard of Pipestone. I need a giggle or two, Mr. Jeff. A giggle or two? <laughs> People like to hear you laugh. <laughs> There's a giggle. There you go. I got a shotgun mic for $20 the other day. Megan, did you like it? Did Jeff pour, put clear down? I would. He didn't. He did not. And I, and I probably should have, but I was just trying to see what it would do if it didn't. And it did what it didn't want it to do. This, I'm not, okay, maybe I shouldn't even say it. I'm so far behind. Thanks for tuning in, Laura. Nice heat gun, what kind is it? This is a Porter Cable, super technical, awesome heat gun. It comes with this, this extension so you can like aim it. Looks like this. 
Oops, sorry. You sure can tear what you're saying? Yeah. People are loving the purple, even if you're not a fan yet. Jeff looks like he's in the zone. He is. Jody from San Diego. Lisa's getting her Lorez pigments tomorrow. You'll love them, Lisa. Nice colors, Jeff. Hi, Christina. The orange is insane. Judy's Kitchen is amazing. I'll make a piece and I get the money for all the equipment. Zach, you don't need that much equipment. You need something to heat up the resin so you can pop the bubbles. You need something to pour on. You need something to protect your space. This is just paper. It's butcher paper. Butcher paper. Hi, Cherie. You need some cups. You need something to mix with. And you need color and resin. It's art resin, we'll just wipe it off. I just really am not being thrilled. I think there's just not enough definition in it. Surprisingly, I like that. Yeah, it does look really soft. Yeah. Is it the ink? Mm -mm. It's uh, powder. I just put just a little bit in there because I, I didn't. You got me nervous about putting too much. <laughs> so I think I just put too little. I said scoop two in if you want to. Oh, that's what I should have done. Do you guys paint the edges or leave them drippy? Zach, it depends on what our clients like. Most prefer an organic edge so that it doesn't look like a print on canvas. And others want it cleaned up so we can sand the edges and spray paint them. You want some bamboo stick? Where is Miss Judy? I'm right here. She's over there holding the pup and keeping time for us. Hey, Stephanie from Studio City. Judy, are you going to pour? No, not tonight. I'm going to wait until I'm in my studio and then we'll all three do it. That'd be so awesome. It works well, but not as well as a 100 plus mic, but way better than the mic on camera. Noted. Thank you, Megan. France, I believe I did get your email. I haven't had time to check and respond emails today or yesterday. I'm behind because I've been working on the stir sticks to get them sent out, but no fear, France. You need your sock guards. Yeah. Shai said it's perfect. I love what Jeff, Jeff just did. Looks kick-ass. That looks nice. Colors are amazing. No worries. Just happy you got it. I will respond to them all tomorrow after I get all the stir sticks shipped out. It looks like you did a puddle pour, mm -hmm. but not. You guys are right on. Been pouring for only two days and I'm totally addicted. It happens. Acrylic pouring is just a gateway drug. Also, I'm going to put that on a t-shirt. The color of your video is a lot better yesterday. It had a yellow tone to it. I think it's the daylight light. It could be. We're using this handy dandy gadget that has lights in it.
Amazing if it's not what you had planned. Love the sparkle. Shy says, stop. It's perfect. I love the pink. It's fantastic. Put more purple. What is the pink? It is something. It's this. Did spade metal flakes. It is basically car glitter. It's different from regular glitter because it's actually metal flake and it may sink in the resin depending on how much other pigments it's on and under. So it's a little bit different from regular glitter. Poly glitter tends to float. Amber said, we all need to chip in, buy a warehouse so we can all make fun stuff and live together and bring all the animals. <laughs> so they can bark all night long. Right? What did I miss with the first 30 minute video? Mixing. Um, we were just mixing. I started a video earlier, but ultimately took it down because the signal strength wasn't that good on our other phone. So I just deleted that video. Go and put more sparkle in it and ruin it. <laughs> Bye, Greg. Make us something amazing. Live videos are the best. So many people prefer the live videos, which is awesome because I've had people mention lately that they prefer the other videos because they're not as long, which I understand. So we'll just have to post some regular videos as well. Jeff, what do you think about those silicone cups now that you've been using them? I don't know. I'm really, I'm, I'm not like, ugh, look at that. It's just getting muddy. I'm really not digging that. Really not digging it. Hmm. <laughs> it looks, like the sparkle looks great, but it's just, these colors are just, I'm muddying it up. Resin commune will you be able to link all of these pigments when you post the video i sure will keisha i try to do that right after i post every video however sometimes it's the next morning when i get it posted but they're always posted Anne's here hi erica jeff and judy sorry i'm late just got home from taking care of my mama i hope your mom's okay miss ann welcome jan Cujo, you be sweet. <laughs> Cujo. Paula Wall said, I want to be you guys when I grow up. That's pretty cool. We don't need no stinking straw. That's funny. That's fun. It looks like it just goes. <laughs> mm-hmm. Well, the it looks great. too. It doesn't look really good on camera either. Normally, it looks fun on camera. Yeah, I don't know. What? What is that? Everybody's really quiet. So. I need my nightly Jerica resin talks. Same, Kelly. Andrew said, good. still looks great, just not to him. This can be a base for something. Mm hmm Just put it in there. Put it in it. Hi, Brenda. Yeah. 
Yeah, they're they're not mine. They're Judy's, but I will take note of everything that we use. I have it all separated over here so that I can know what to let you guys know that I he used. That one's been well poured on. Yeah. Claudia says it looks good. Zach says it looks good. Cosmic. Seventies, uh, kind of. Uh, I don't know what do you call it? Psychedelic. Mm-hmm. It looks a little bit like one of the tables that we did. Wow. Just. If, if I tilt it, it's gonna pull it off. Well, the, just pull the tray out and put it on it, and then slide it in. It's resting on the other one above it. Need to make some Cujo videos. He's so cute to watch. He's over there, napping at the door, hanging out. Um. Well, I hope she's okay, Ann. Looks awesome. Nice one, Jeff. My purple dirt, dirty pour did not come out great last night. I can't remember right. the and last time I did a dirty pour that you, you said you have more cups? turned out right. I'm gonna do these. Yeah. Just try it a geode. Uh, that's what it was starting to look like. Um, what size cups do you want, Jeff? I mean, I have, I have. I was thinking that idea is. Size, and they're right there. Uh -huh. And you can measure them with those. They have measurements on them, too. Cujo sounds like a tiny motor revving up. This is true. Okay. I'm afraid these are too big. This is for the color. It's not for the... Mm -hmm. Hi, Pop. Good to go, boy. These, right? Yes. Yeah. Be there some this size cups. I have those sizes. She's there. They're hard plastic, which gives you a little more security. Miss Owens, thank you for letting me know how you feel about the live videos. We like doing them for sure. Need to get a baker's rack. It's a great idea. It is a good idea. Everybody loves your shelving unit. Roxanne says the orange looks like cinnamon spice from La Rez. I don't think I've gotten that color. Need something like that for your marathon pours. It's handy. And then she has some a cover that like zips around it that keeps all the dust out. It's brilliant. Crystal says that you're really sweet, Erica. Your responses are always kind, even when we ask the same questions over and over and over. I'm so busy, but I must watch live ATD. That's so kind of you to say, Crystal. And I really don't mind repeating myself. Um, I mean, people only ask because they want to know the answer. And I'm here to answer. And we get new viewers all the time. Right? Yeah. I love the rug Cujo's laying on. The beautiful bright rug for sure. What about this one? <laughs> this one is paint proof. Right. How old is Cujo? He just turned eight. Do you remember the name of the resin you used from Hobby Lobby and was it decent? That is Envirotex Light and it is decent. 
We used it for a long time. And we still use it from time to time. It's, it's not a bad resin at all. How many drops did you put in there? Just... Just one squeeze? Squeeze and then I did a little bit more just because I figured it would be transparent and it pretty much is. Erica, did you pick Cujo because he's so portable? Um, I picked him because he was unique looking and I did research on the breeder and she was good and I called all of her references and the vet and everybody said she was awesome. So that's, that's why I picked my little man. Idea says I always find it difficult working on a piece outside of my own workspace. We just like to art. And we feel really comfortable at Judy's, so. Yeah, and the whole fact that she has everything. You know, that's like going to somebody's house and they don't have anything. And, or if you forget something, you know, you bring it and then they don't have it. And It's all here. She's that, prepared. You know, it would be very transparent. Hello but from Bermuda. For this. For this wood. Night, Jody. Tell your son we said Hi. We all need to do a pour together, exact same colors and the exact same pour technique and see how different everybody's pours come out. Post them all to the same place. That would be amazing. That would be a lot of fun. We should do like a purple something for Lupus Awareness Month. I would say you guys show resin usage. That is not sloppy. My first was not so neat. My first one didn't even set, so... You're probably ahead of me. Hey, Jeff, do you think I could mix in a bronze to a purple to make it a deeper royal bronze? Deeper? I, I don't see why not. I don't know. I've never tried that. Mixing copper and purple to make a deep royal purple? I would, I would, I would do a blue. I would mix I a blue in. A blue. Mm -hmm. like, you know what? Put... A real, uh, a real deep teal. That would that makes a that makes an amazing purple. It's true. All right. I use a resin called Super Glaze tonight. Pretty much the same thing as Envirotex. It is very similar. We've used Super Glaze before. It's not bad at all. Thank you, Kelly. Yeah. It might make it look interesting anyway. I just realized the ATD show has their first special. Do you need to do clear first? I don't have any. I thought you had one. Mm -mm. Yeah. I, don't, no. I, don't, I don't want to do clear because then it'll, it won't let it sit. That's right. And it wouldn't it won't stay in the wood. Right. Do you have to prep the wood cradle board at all? We're about to test that. We've always prepped ours yeah. since we had issues with air coming through and leaving these little like bubbly pock marks, I guess, is weird. So we're testing it now. Oh, well, that was that tabletop that you were on. Yeah. That was prime. Mm hmm. And it degasses. It definitely did all over the place. I remember that video. We've added to it since then. I just haven't posted the video. Does Judy have a YouTube channel? Krista, she doesn't yet, but she's gonna. We're gonna get her set up. Yeah, Shai, I definitely did do research on picking Cujo. I figured that since I was purchasing a dog instead of rescuing a dog, which my family's always rescued their animals, um, Do you want me to start mixing up some more resin for you, Jeff? I wanted to um, make sure that it wasn't I, a puppy I, I mill. Just, I don't know what this is going to do, so I'm just going to do it by hand. I see y'all using more yellow lately. We're trying to make it work. Try and, we want to be friends with yellow. Yeah, we want to be friends with yellow. 
Rod says you two are incredibly good at not getting resin all over. It's a struggle sometimes. It is for me. Not only do I love your lives, but I also love chat and everyone in here. Agreed. Deeper royal purple. I ran out of color and wanted to see how I can get a deep red purple. Everything I've chosen so far is too light. Brenda, mix a, like a teal or a navy blue into your purple. And it should give you the deep royal color you're looking for. Where's that Ardisu royal purple? Wasn't that really deep? It is. The Ardisu purple is really deep. Night Roxanne. Jeff needs closed captions. He's just in the zone tonight, but he's gonna we're getting him a mic, promise. Did you guys prime the wood panels? We usually do, we didn't this time. Prime the first one, not this one. Yeah. First one was primed, this one is not. And I agree, Shy is amazing. Welcome, Gloria. Have you ever tried nail polish and resin? I did, but I used a really cheap nail polish because I wasn't sure how it would work and I didn't want to waste an expensive nail polish. However, I should have used a more expensive nail polish because they're more pigmented and I almost had to use like half the bottle of nail polish to get any kind of deep color. I didn't even use one of that. Welcome, Nikki. I love this teal. What is this? This is a turquoise. Yeah, you can add this. Watch when this when this touches this magenta right here, or this. What, no, it's not magenta. This is called red velvet. How did you meet Judy? Um, she was commenting on some of our videos, and she was super nice. And we started messaging, and we talked in some groups and she's super knowledgeable and easy to talk to and our just friendship grew from there and now we have dinners and paint together i used to hate yellows and orange till i watched atd we're still struggling with both of those colors i've learned from jeff how to not get resin all over everything except my hair I still have problems. Scissors, basically that's what you're, <laughs> you're limited to. Ellen said, I will never be friends with yellow. So far we are not friends with yellow either, but maybe today will change. Hey, AB. Can we still order artist Sue? Um, right now, Sue is having some family problems, so I don't think her site is up for orders right now, but I will let you guys know when I have an update on that. This reminds me of this thing that my grandmother had in front of her Christmas tree. She had a silver Christmas tree, and it, it would turn, so it would turn different colors. I remember those. That reminds me of when you were a kid and you had the parachute game where, like, you, like, have to lift it up and run under it real quick and hold it down. Um, it was rainbow colored, me much of like this. That you had to, it, you had to match whatever color flashed up. You had to hit that color. Did Simon you, says, no. the Simon. No, Simon. Yeah, Simon. Simon. Yeah. That was. We had we just got a Simon game not too long ago, and it it's was, it was left out on the sidewalk. Somebody put it on the sidewalk. Oh, you know what? We should, do, we should do a spill, of a spill paint thing. The new kind that we're doing? Yeah. Will this stuff, can we peel off of this paper? Yeah. It doesn't, the resin doesn't stick to it at all? Mm -hmm. I use it. Hopefully those little bubbles aren't a sign. Well, I 
take it back. The cinnamon dip has the shiny side up. It looks shiny. This one is off to a unique start. It would look cool with a giant swirl. Everybody said they've had one of those Christmas trees too. Yeah. Exactly, Andrea, the gym class parachute thing. Artistry will be back online Sunday, May 13th at noon. I'm about Australia to try time. A brand new line. I love that you can see the wood. Hmm. <laughs> I'm about to try a brand new line of resin tints, colors, and it's called Color Obsession. And I've got an order in, and as soon as I get it, I'm going to give some to Jeff and and Erica and let them uh, play with it some. That would be. I've looked at their colors. They're pretty brilliant. And they're coming out with a whole bunch of tints, too. Don't they have, like, alcohol inks or some kind of it's, inks? Well, they're tints. Oh, okay. They're, yeah. They're specifically made to color resin. So they don't, like, fade over time? Right. I love that you can see the wood in that. Hmm. Erica, any more thoughts on seminar or workshop with ATD? Jan, we're planning one for June 2nd in Dallas. Um, shoot us an email. I don't have... It's artist till death. Can someone type out our email? <laughs> I'm loving seeing the wood grain through. Yeah, that looks... I love that. So many, hoping. that's what she said, popped yeah. up earlier. <laughs> Cindy says, I ordered some color obsession also. What? Cindy Stevens said she ordered color obsession as well. I'm, I'm putting together a group order for people in the state, but, you know. Yeah, if you guys check out color obsession and would like to try out some of those colors, um, email Miss Judy. Have you ever used silicone to help create the cells? Mm, yes, but I wouldn't recommend it because cleaning up after it is just oh, more than thing. it's worth. It's so right here and out of the way. <laughs> wow. Great, now we have to go buy a bake pan. <laughs> That's great. GT's two eyes. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, Miss Judy. Have you tried any of the art resin colors? We've tried, wait, no, not any of the art resin colors. One day. I tried them and I didn't like them. What was it you didn't like about them? They didn't color up enough for me. So they weren't very, like, deep colors? They, they just weren't. I gave them to my granddaughter. Hmm. Judy says no go on art resin tints. You need to do dirty pour? Yeah. I'm just using all of this. I'm going to see what, what the colors will be. PJ Busby wants to try Color Obsession. They have cool stuff. Erica, how many grams of pigment do you need to use for that size of canvas? That was a uh, 12 by 12. Yeah. And. It's a lot on the table. Um. I used. It was 12 ounces. I mean, 12 ounces know. of resin. Grams yeah, of pigment. Two. Oh, I was. I think he did like two did, squirts of that stuff. One, in, well, he did one and a half squirt of the ink. ink. And he did, on the first one, he did just an eighth of a teaspoon. Because I, yeah. I, I had, I told, I sculpted him about using too much of the pigment. And he worried that uh, I thought that was he paint. was going to use too much. And I had told him, just use one or two scoops. And he didn't hear the two scoops. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, two squirts or two eighth scoops? Yeah. Eight, two eighths is a quarter of a, of a... Right. I don't know how much that is in grams. I don't either. That's why I have a converter app. 
Oh, handy. What is the official name of that rack? It's, hold on, I'll look it up for you. What is it called? The double D's. B. <laughs> double D rack. I see. Brenda, Miss Judy set me up with Color Obsession. Can't wait to try them. I can hear Erica in my mind from each video saying they're how to contact at. Good. That means my repetition is working. Control. Ellen says art resin colors have to be shaken forever. Karen, I hope your headache is gets better. I wish Eli Kim had a U.S. distributor. I want to try their Resi Crete. Kitty. Look at this little guy. So it was this top one? Yeah, this other one. Got it. It was this guy. 10 tier bun rack sheet pan with brake wheel. And you have to get the, hold on a second. You have to get these two. Oh, it doesn't come with those? No. So you also have to get those. Tiger Chef full size aluminum sheet pan bakery equipment. Full size. $118? Jeez. Well, they last forever. You get 12 of them. It's two extra. Oh, okay. You can maybe find them cheaper, like a, uh, a local restaurant, a restaurant store. Yeah. Leanne said those silicone co cups cost sixty-two dollars to ship to Australia. Bananas. Oh what are the colors Jeff is currently mixing up? Especially that one that looks like orange red. M. That one. I believe was that orange ink over there that I will tell you the color in a minute. That is crazy. All those. AB, that sounds you can amazing. See all those colors because of the glitter together. That is so fun. Ron said you should just change your email and web address to two T's and two L's since you say it so much. Not a bad idea. Clearly those shelves were made for me. Need to do a beach theme painting for a young man for his mom for Mother's Day. What colors look the best? Well, if it's a beach, we're gonna need two kinds of blue, a white, and I would just paint the base of like, I would just paint the canvas tan because the tan color will make your whole painting a muddy, horrible mess. I hate working with tan. These things are going to be like glass. That color would look good. Electric blue. Also, there's another color over here that I wanted to use. I can't open that. Is that a tile or just a mini canvas? It's a tiny canvas. Oh. Oh, there it is. That color looks like this. Focus. It's like silver light blue and it would look amazing in a beach scene. It's called Caribbean Blue. Caribbean Blue. And it looks a lot like Jacquard's, the pigment from Jacquard that I like to use a lot. It's got a real glittery look to it. It well, smells a little bit. The tile is bananas. Love the glitter. Batch? I don't know. I feel like I'm out of my color funk. Meaning. 
<laughs> well, blue color. You want to do one, Erica? Yeah. Okay. Let me run out and get a little. Have you ever tried one shot paint resin? I have not. The name of that one was Caribbean Blue by Artisu. Drop a tile upside down in that pile of resin. Um, I don't have any tiles. Had to go pick up my niece and miss what you guys thought about doing a huge group pour. The consensus was we're down, huh? So we're always down for group pour. You gonna take over? Oh yeah. We're gonna look at this first. Yeah, it's still ugly. <laughs> Bye, Leanne. We need to just stick with colors that. This big mess. These little cups. That looks fun. It's like I get ahead of myself when I pick all these colors. Bye, Leanne. Night, Nancy. Yeah, I'm not really happy with it. Um, I think I just tried to put too many colors in one and and they're all metallic, but you can't see them. <laughs> they just got real muddy. But this is fun. Look at that, that's just fun. Camera. I have some of those canvas boards too, if you would rather. Oh, that was just fine. Thank you. Okay. Her dogs. Give up. <laughs> <laughs> Both baby girls. Hi, Andrea. Oh, I don't have a big screen for you to read. I know. You can read on the iPad. Um. Mm, I think I'll be all right. I'll... These glasses are different. The ones that I was using before were, like I picked them up at CVS and they were just, I think they just weren't what I normally wear. And I can, this is fine here. Yeah, who is your, on your top five artist list? Uh, Alphonse Mucha is probably number one. Yeah. Um, He's an art nouveau. Frank Frazetta is up there. Um, this guy named Crayola, which is, he is beyond phenomenal. He's on YouTube. Um, gosh, who else? Um... I don't know. I'm like, I gotta think about that. Um, man, I don't think anybody's ever asked me that. Samantha says, magenta glitter that you added the ink to. Fan freaking fabulous color. Yeah, that one is. One. Kelly, the peacock painting has a new home. <laughs> so we're it. Sorry. Hi, Jennifer. Thank you, Cherie. I think you're adorable, too. Could you hear her say that? She said thank you.
Our guest is Judy. Special guest star. <laughs> it's, it's just her, her dog is right in her face. The dog needs all the attention. They're, they're, they're the attention getters around here. They rule. They do. Yes, they are Maltese, James Mutzel. Yes, the famous Judy. That's her. You know what's so great about art resin is that I haven't even picked my colors yet and I'm mixing resin. I would have never, oh, yeah. ever done that with another brand. Like, Good timing, Judy morphed into a Maltese. I guess I should think about that though. I know how you feel. The struggle for what colors is real. Mm -hmm. Look here, not up here. You look like you're blind. <laughs> <laughs> I forget that I'm not talking to you. I should be talking to Athena. It's true. I forget. Do gold and pink. Ooh, that sounds fun. Yeah, gold and pink. Kelly, and Kelly Portland. Green. Kelly Green said that. Since Philly Phil's not in there giving out suggestions, challenges. Philly Phil. Well, sounds like I'm going to be doing gold and pink. I, I thought about that, Ron. Try a blind resin pour sometime. <laughs> you tell them how we're going to colors in the future um and we 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 love teals and purples and golds and all that fun stuff but we do that so much yeah we don't want to get stuff in the same color all the time it would be easy if you have one pink but you have 100 pinks Gold, pink, and plum. There's a lot of pinks to choose from here. There's lipstick pink plus the powders that are. There's a raspberry and. Um, I really like there's this a, one. There's a raspberry uh, epoxy up there too. That I just found it in the box. I forgot I had. It's so bananas. You have every color I ever made. Are you doing the challenge for lupus? We will be. We will be. We talked about having everybody do the purple pores and send them in and, and just see how different everybody's look using the same colors. Yeah, and the same like technique, like it would be a puddle pour versus a Any other kind? All the other kinds? There's Personal kinds. question from my own knowledge, sorry. I get what you mean because I find myself going to certain colors. I'm curious what yours were too. Green ice? Is that too muted, you think? Pretty color. Chocolate, cobalt. I don't know what um, Clara said. Where will we post the purple pores for the challenge? Hashtag. You can do hash right hashtag purple. A D T R. Yeah. Purple. Or what is it? Or we could put it what, in what's the, the, what's the challenge? lupus to do something ADT. with purple. ADT lupus or 
ADT LPP. Lupus happy Elma, form. yet. Oh, happy Elma, then? Mm -hmm. This is such a great color. Oh, yeah. Is that that deep purple? No, it's amazing teal. Oh. That I obviously have to use now because I saw it. I made eye contact, so. <laughs> now that goes. Um, I think I'll do teal, red velvet, and gold. Keep it simple. Hashtag ATD art. That way it all comes back. Yeah. Okay. Just keep it the hashtag ATD art. ART. So, I guess. Do we want to do it like a week to do it? Or is it going to be all till the end of the month? Um, I don't know. Apple, green, coffee, and bronze. I don't know about that, Mona. Are you drinking, Mona? <laughs> that sounds interesting. I think green and coffee would go together. I'm scared about that bronze. Gold. You have plenty of gold. So many golds. I'm going to use this one. It looks Whatever. like it's not that's gold. Not, that's, the that's bronze or copper, yeah. Where did we have it on? Is it out? That's the sound noise I've never heard. <laughs> Is Kendra over there? Um, He's sleeping right there. Uh, there's a there's an artisan powder gold. It's so Didn't we just have gold. one over here? I think I have Mamron around here somewhere too. Pretty sure. I feel like we saw it last time we were here. Once I get things set up, I'll know where everything is for about a week. You'll know where it is for a week? Uh huh. And then who knows? Exactly. We know it'll be in the Everything will start out alphabetized. Delane, I wish you all the best of luck. What's she doing? She's Can going in to a clinic for lupus check to check for lupus next week. Judy said she wishes you the best of luck, Delane. Happy L, yes they are. Yes, we're at Judy's. <laughs> we're gonna kidnap her to our studio soon. That is a great color, man. Isn't that, I'm pretty sure Judy sent us home with this color. I don't think so. It's it's a brighter one. Oh, we don't have this deep teal. Mm -mm. That may be the newest one that I got. But you can go home with that one. I've got a whole supply. An accent? You have an accent? Huh? <laughs> you have an accent? Me? That's what somebody said. They love your accent. Oh, it's just pure Texas. Just all Texas. Southern bread. I feel like I need a white in there for some reason. I think you need to, should all move in with Judy. <laughs> <laughs> the poor house is 12 by 16, I believe. But part of that's got a bathroom in it with a shower. I know, your little poor house is amazing.
Yes, Kelly, but I love an Aussie draw too. There are so many Aussies in this. I need to get, I, I don't like holding this. Hold on guys, I'm gonna get, um, can I get your toy? Yeah. I just need to look at her countertops. They're so awesome. Hold on, guys. I'm going to get up my thing here. Yeah, you, you guys see where the, the peacock is going? Right up there. Maybe that was the old resin. Yeah, it'd be fine. Start resin. The only thing is, I have a couple of sparkles in there now. Wish I had three hands here. Next time we come up, we're going to have Judy pour with us. I'm gonna have to set you guys down for a second. Hold on. Work. Sorry about that. Orientation is locked. No, oh. you turned it differently. Sorry. Alright, guys. Put you in this little holder. That's so much better. This thing starts up like a car. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, Natalie. I was, I was uh, putting the phone on a, on a, uh, what is this called? Gimbal. <laughs> no, it's not. This is not the gimbal. This is uh, yeah. just a tripod. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. It's it's tough holding the little phone like, and it burns my hand because it's Apple. Oh, jokes. Oh, <laughs> Da, da, da. Da. Mine's bigger than yours, Jeff. Yeah. That's what she <laughs> said. Rod hit it. T W S S. With her mom for another week. She's gonna be with her mom for another week. Mm -hmm. So then Low battery, 20%. I've got a plug. Yeah, she can put cord on it. Oh. Yeah, I would bear that white will take over. I'm more concerned about the gold, like since she said it. The goes. phone needs a sippy sippy. The phone. It needs some apple juice. Get it? I do. Got a cord. You 
probably said maybe. Who else is going? Hey! You gonna come art? No. No. Just no. Maybe next time. He does not want to go in there. That's what she said. Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Could you have the water of the mums? I'm sure he's close to out of everything by now. Has to be. Do those cups have holes in them? No, it's dripping down the front. Oh. Look at their cells underneath that. That's so crazy looking. It's bananas. Thanks, Jojo. It looks it looks great. Thanks, Candy. So serious. Why so serious? So serious. I don't know what the blue is. It's deep teal by... I think it's just regular teal. Artist who? Oh. Love that. It's teal. Teal, teal. My artist Sue. Pretty bananas color. That is what I love when it starts to do that. Look how fun that is. Wow. Don't say that because I'm going to change it and they're going to hate me. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Gorgeous, Erica. Wow. Beautiful colors. I don't think you could go Wood grain wrong. negative pour. Hey, that's something. That could be a thing. I think it's just the leak from. What are you gonna do? I don't know. Don't. Can I, can I fill that in? Yeah, oh, go ahead. <laughs> no. You can't. This seat's taken. Well, yeah. Pour some, I, I would just pour some clear. It. I would pour clear right there. Yeah. So then it'll flood over to here. You don't clear left, do you? Um, I have a little bit left. Okay. What gold and white is that? Sorry, I missed it. Jojo, the gold right there next to you. is this stuff. Um, I'm not sure what it is. Gold leaf and metallic. Gold leaf and metallic powders. It's a pretty deep gold too. It's a, it's a, it's a, Extra brilliant. It pops up 
pops up like Mehron does. Yeah. And the white is... Uh, Snow White by Artisu. Snow White by Artisu. That is super fun. Have you ever worked with marine paint? Marine paint? I want to play with it, but I feel like, oh, man. <laughs> it's kind of neat with that wood. I think so, too. Face. Good save. I think. Um, it's kind of neat with the wood. With did the wood you put the clear? Uh, I haven't added more. I, I, would, I would just put some right there. I think that's a thumbprint. Um, the gold, it's called gold leaf and metallic powders. This would be a great start to a geode. Yes. It would. It's gorgeous. It's really pretty. Number 13. If that makes any difference. I have resin left. Do you want to do these colors? You like doing another one? How do you have it? You don't have any resin. Oh, yeah, be fun. I'm gonna put I just these don't on think that's enough, though. Back. There's a board right there that you can see, but you may have to wipe it off, though. Going in the rack. All right, do you want 9 by 12 or is that 10 by 10? Um, 9 by 12, that's what you did, 9 by 12? Mm-hmm. That seemed Um, I don't think that's enough resin, though. Plus, I could be have... stirring some up for you. My two cents. Thanks, y'all. What up, Philly Phil? You're late to the party. Late. Laura Usher said big hugs to all of you. Hi, Laura. We did that one, and then that, one that one, oh. that one, and <laughs> that <laughs> one. Make the full, uh, how many ounces is this? Just do... Uh, this is eight ounces. I would do like... And it's pretty neat. Like, I'm going to have to invest in one. It's a brilliant idea. Especially since there's like a zipper... Do, like uh, protective case that goes around it. I would just do two two ounces. One so you want four all together? The size board no. I did was nine by twelve. So one and one. Yes. Okay. Can Thanks, Helen. Have a good night. I see a rack in my future. Everybody loves it. I love it too. It's the one I just did. It looks a lot more vibrant under the, the lights that we have in here. Is that just a regular piece of wood? No, it's um like a wood canvas board. Beautiful. Thank you, Laura. One peacock came to Judy's house and Erica did another amazing peacock. Love it. I love that piece. Jeff's probably about to one-up my poor. Oh, you need a star stick? Yes, I do. I could use this. I haven't... 
Where did you guys get the canvas boards? Are they from Blick? Did you get those uh, from Blick? The canvas boards I got from Blick. I, they're, uh, they're, yeah, I got them on sale at Blick. There you go. Wow, Jeff, you're right. That is a nice rack, Rod said. <laughs> Erica. Ma'am. Notwithstanding. Right. Ellen said, gotta run. I said, bye. Bye, Ellen. Where did she get that rack? Is it a restaurant kitchen rack? It is a restaurant kitchen rack. I would just dump that upside down on that so it's not wasted. Um, I showed a video of where she ordered it. She ordered it off Amazon, and it's a bun rack. Are you cheating on Greg? We're not. I just, I couldn't get to Greg's place today to grab some of the boards, so I will pick some up. Because he had, he made a special piece for Judy, so we'll be getting it before we come back up here again. Greg said, holy crap, you guys are still going. What? We've only been on for an hour and a half. <laughs> Wait till I do my 24-hour pour. Oh, yeah. By the way, that's... I thought I'm gonna do a 24 I hour. I thought we said 12. Now let, we're thinking about it. I, I want to do a 24 hour day. He wants to film for 24 hours. YouTube, you do that. The, if you're the longest video on YouTube that takes you 24 days to watch. <gasps> yeah. Or something like that. It's a slideshow. It's not the most oh. interesting video. Oh. But if you're if you're a partner with YouTube, like we're partners with YouTube, you can post any length video. If you're not, I think the max is 15 minutes. Okay. Pretty sure. All right. Let's have it. Tiffany said, can I send the $10 for the two coast service from the other night through the chat here? Would that be okay? Um, yeah, you could send it through here. Um, shipping would probably, I'm not sure about shipping, but Tiffany, I'll check and let you know about shipping. So glad I have turned her off. Don't put me in timeout, Judy. <laughs> she sent John. John's not here. Where is John? I don't know. Kelly Quincy said, 24-hour pour, hell yeah. Well, I just think about it. Like, a lot of, you know, a lot of our fans and followers and people, they're either asleep when we do it or they're at work or... It's just not a good time. So I thought, why not try to give everybody a good time? <laughs> mm -hmm. I can see those little bottles in his future. Those right. Little, uh, no dose things. Right. It'd be yeah, all the Red Bull. Oh my gosh, no <laughs> Clara said 24 hours. Better get a taller baking rack. <laughs> Can't wait, Jeff. I got to be in on it. Oh my God. Are you kidding? I'm so calling in sick that day. Go for it. That's a great idea. Jeez, uh, Jeff, give me advance notice so I can take two days off. Kat <laughs> Von D style. Live stream that. I won't get anything done all day. 24 hours I'm in for the marathon. You no, know, Kat Von D stole, stole that, that idea. idea from her ex husband, Oliver Peck. Jeff and Oliver are friends. They were supposed to do it together. Hmm? <laughs> they were supposed to do that together, and and uh, she went ahead and did it by herself on her show, and then he, he did it on uh, himself at Elm Street Tattoo, the 24-hour uh, for Guinness Book of World's Record. 
And then he beat her by like so many. Like he just, he went nuts. Well, I bet you you'd be a world record resin pour. I looked that up. Like how many colors is the most colors in a resin pour or how many gallons and they don't have an existing one right now. So we would have to apply. Basically it'd be easier to set, to break a record than to set a new one. Yeah. As weird as that is, but I guess that makes sense. You'd have to have a whole big floor space. You'd have to have a really big, big canvas. Yeah. How do you get to be a partner? They've changed the rules on YouTube since we became a partner. When we became a partner, you had to have 10,000 channel views and I think 1,000 subscribers. Um, but it has changed since then. And I'm not really sure what the prerequisite is now. Billy Phil said, thanks for allowing us into your new place, Miss Judy. Your hospitality is appreciated. Well, you're welcome anytime. I ordered stir sticks. Can you send them with those or do I need to pay more shipping? If so, it's cool. No, I can send them with your stir sticks, which I plan on shipping out manana. That's the plan. So yeah, Tiffany, um, I can just add them in the same package. Can't wait, 24 hour pour, you go, Jeff. That's what she said. So many dirty comments I'm holding in. Man down. Nope. Okay. All right, I'm back. A 24 hour pour would be awesome. Super Bowl pour, that's true. I'm up all night anyways, I'll be there. That's funny. It would be interesting to see how the art would change with exhaustion. Sam, that is, that would be an amazing observation. Well, what, what, what I would do, like I was talking about earlier, is, is have guests come, other artists, you know, and, and maybe do their interpretation of a pour. Like, that had no idea, like, uh, my friend Detox uh, is an amazing artist, and I think he would go crazy with resin. You know what would be amazing is if we had all of your artist friends come and since none of them work with resin, like see how they would adapt to it. You know, since they all have different styles, you have tattoo artist friends, mural artist friends. Yeah. I think it would be awesome. It'd be like... My friend Rudy a telethon. is amazing with colors. He's a tattoo artist. Rod, thank you for the tip towards 24-hour pour. Shai said, a different kind of me too. That's funny. I love Jeff's laugh. It's so cute. Agreed. Hey, Tammy. Clara said, didn't he do over 500 tattoos in one day? I believe he did. Yeah, he did like 750. Um, the first time he did it, I got this one. It was number one, Cindy. That This is a part of the, his first Guinness book. Sharon, I'm sure the pour didn't turn out awful. Like, Jeff thinks his first pour today turned out awful, but it didn't. Sometimes you just have to let it rest and come back tomorrow and... It settles and moves when you're not doing anything to it because it self levels. So you never know if you're actually going to hate it till the next day. I am completely in love with this one now. I love it. Erica, that. what number is on the gold leaf metallic powders? Will you? 13. Um, That's what it said. None of that is... Hashtag 13. Number 13. Hashtag. <laughs> um, it's number 13, extra brilliant, rich gold. Oops. I found it on Amazon, but they don't do prime. It comes from another person. Look at um, that. I'm loving that. Shy, I can't ever get a dirty pour to look That's good. That's gorgeous, Jeff. Oh, 
Oliver is awesome on Ink Master. Thank you, Tiffany. Noted. Paid in full. Bye, Angel. See you soon. I Thank you. This. Let me see this so they can see it. Like, does this move? Yeah, it's on the stand. Candy has a matching burn with mine, but on her foot. I put my heat gun on the floor, but not where I usually put it. So I slid my foot over while I was tilting. Yowza. Wow. I want to see. <laughs> Can you see it? Mm -hmm. I love it. Y'all, this is what mine looks like now. It's still there. Do we have? It's a perfect impression of the front of a heat gun. What's your name? Tweezers? Yes. Here. Tiffany, thank you very much. She gave us a tip to go towards the epic 24-hour pour idea. <laughs> Bye, Angel awesome. Heart. Bye, Tammy. My phone needs a sippy sippy. Very yeah, dragon light. Phenomenal, Jeff. Looks like a gold Chinese dragon. The oh, magnifier like helps. It. The mag light. Sippy, Night, sippy. PJ. That's great. I love it. Definitely doing some fun stuff. You could just use one of these, like, if you do an ocean pour, just leave raw wood. Mm. If you put it on any of those other trays. <laughs> Mm. I just, what are you going to say? So, but just let this be bare or like use a clear for the sand part. Yeah, that is so. It'd be perfect. Yeah. I don't think my Super phone is feeling like charging on this. Super happy. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. I kind of like what you got on no. Paper. That's fun. It's <laughs> fun. Thanks, Judy, for having us those, in your home. Did you bring any of those paper? Uh, we, we were going to. Night, Margo. Um, we have just a little bit of resin left. That much. Um. We'll just pour on whatever we cover and let you call the rest of it negative space. Boom. Science, but that one's falling. It's falling out a little bit. Natural wood. I know. My bad. You need Not to charge using an iPad working. block while you're streaming. I feel like you're right, Megan. Night, CJ. Can you imagine? When we do the 24-hour pour, we're gonna be saying goodnight to people all day. <laughs> like all around the world. All day and all night. All over the world. I'm, I'm getting even more stoked about it. How people think I was crazy. See you, Tiger Mouse. Good luck studying. my craziness. Hey guys, I said hi. What's up, Steve? I love that people say our, I said hi and bye. Becky said, just got here. 24 hour pour, question mark, exclamation point, exclamation point. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? So here's what's up. Jeff wants to do a 24 hour pour feed so that, um, we're gonna have like guest artists come in that have never worked with resin that he's friends with. He's got mural artists, tattoo artists, well, paintbrush artists. We get so many people from all over the world that, you know, they're asleep when we do it, you know, or they're getting up for work or they're, you know, they're, they're 
give everybody a chance to check it out and have fun. With the live feed. And we're mm -hmm. thinking about doing it in honor of um, uh, suicide. suicide prevention and awareness. Yes. I'm not sure what size flake these are. All it says is don't eat them. <laughs> the long version of don't eat them. Which anybody who would eat them couldn't read that. Right. Charge the batteries. I have it plugged into a charger, but it's just, I think because it's a live feed, it's just not charging fast enough to keep up. Night, Greg. I can see me putting you up in 24 hour pour on the TV. Talking to you guys while working in the studio. Not actually typing, but talking back to you. It's fine with us. It's our pleasure to be nice to everybody, Lynn. Thank you for hosting Judy and Joy the Pours. Night, Erica and Jeff and Judy. Beautiful work. I said night. Night. Night, Cindy. <laughs> night, night. What was the point zero zero one five on top of that? I don't know. I guess that's probably the size. That would make sense. Susie Q 0 0.015. That may be the size. Um, they look like regular glitter size flakes. What are your thoughts on cadmium pigments? I've never tried them. Judy, have you tried cadmium pigments? Well, there's cadmium yellow and cadmium red. Uh, Liquitex has taken their, taken cadmium out of their paint. Um, you know, I just, if you don't touch them and, you know, get them real friendly with them, I don't have a problem. <laughs> real friendly with them? Don't get friendly with the cadmiums. Check. Clara said, awesome reason, suicide prevention. We lost our nephew due to suicide. And his mother, my sister, four months later, I'm all in. I'm sorry you had to go through that, Clara. Jeff lost a really close friend of his. Um, so we're going to do it for the awareness. Night, Samantha. The Art Sherpa. I will definitely check that out. Cool Dragon. That's what I was making. <laughs> I was trying to make like a dragon, but it didn't work out too well. Was there a thing where most cadmium is being mined by kids and that's why some of the paint makers quit using it? I'm not... It's not healthy for your liver. Tried it several times and it's not fun, but life is better now. Night shy. I'm thinking about figuring out how to do that donation button that goes directly to the cause in the videos. There should be a little dollar sign next to your name. Can you see this on the You got at the bottom of it. Oh, yeah, yeah. But that goes to us, and I don't, I'm trying to, I want to figure out if I can just add a, like, a donation link that goes straight to the charity and doesn't go like through us because that'll you set up a for I probably could I'll check it out you're melting your dragon that is just not wanting to stay there and I'm glad that doesn't hit your foot and burn you <laughs> I'm glad too it was nice to meet you, Judy. Thank you for hosting tonight. You rock. This chick has hit the hay. Contractors coming early in the morning. New kitchen coming. Yeah. Awesome, Sherry. Have a good night. Good night, Sherry. That's awesome. 
Not enough resin. Not enough resin. See, I tried to make double and you said two. <laughs> right. You have a little bit of white left, that's about it. Maybe a little bit of gold. I haven't been able to do the chat donation for you guys. I may need a YouTube account, which I don't have. Thank you for the thought, Natalie. We appreciate it. After, after we do the lupus pour, can we do a challenge for MS? I'm absolutely down for that, Jennifer. JoJo says, I see something I shouldn't say. I'm scared. <laughs> Hey, Jessica, it is quite late. That's a good idea, Clara. I also want to do one for Parkinson's because that's something my dad's dealing with. That wood grain, it looks so different, like from an angle. I know, it looks different here than it does up here. That gold's. I really think we ought to try some. Maybe we ought to do that. Try what? Staining it, like we were talking about. Oh, yeah. What, Cujo? I think he's trying to tell me he wants to go to the outside. Wanna go outside? That's that's the poor house right there. Isn't it cute? Now Cujo's gonna go pee on everything. No more dragon. You can see it's still a dragon. And for fibromyalgia, yeah. Thanks, Judy, for having Jeff and Erica. You rock like always. Got to get up early and make that money. Bye, Kelly. You could auction one paintings for charity. Barbara J., I'd be so down. Loving the colors. Great snake head with the upper right. Love the idea of 24-hour suicide prevention. Lost my job of 10 years on Monday, my therapy this week is you two can't say enough about what an impact you guys have ripples tracy i'm sorry to hear about that it's a snakehead now okay good no more bad things <laughs> love the elegant simplicity of the poor it is definitely simple i.e almost ran out of resin I do like it too. Like scoop some of that you got down on the paper oh, to see if you can dribble it on there if you want. Where's the uh... you need a wipe? Wipe? Huh? Those may be empty. He's got a uh, package over there that's. I thought I had some rags out here. I folded them up carefully so you put your alcohol on. Thanks, Natalie. That's good. We're good. We're good to go. My dog and cat are annoyed I'm watching you guys instead of giving them their bedtime treats. I love your elegant simplicity. What is your average viewer per hour, and would it sustain the amount of viewers through 24 hours? Oop. I would pour different hours of your day for a week for before doing 24 hours to see the viewer average. Um, we're consistently... Over 120, between 120 and 150 throughout the two hour pours that we do. <coughs> Bless you. Excuse me. Bless you. Thank you. Um, I think we should start a 12 hour, like try 12 hour one first, but Jeff doesn't think that would have as much of an impact. So I don't know. We, I'm sure we could. I it think. is a big commitment, but I mean, what else we got to do? We're going to art. Yeah. So, may as well art on film. Yeah. Hey, Kim. This is what we did earlier. So, right now, there's a snake on the table. 
<laughs> and We're experimenting with negative space and wood. Jeff did this earlier, which looks pretty boss. Let's see. Isn't that great? So fun. I love Simple the wood. and elegant. You what? That is terrible. I did that earlier. I had no direction, no plan of attack. Look at that. It's so much more vibrant in person than on the phone. Jeff did that little guy. Did that gold do really cool stuff? I didn't work mine long enough. Tamara, that is not a bad combo. I suffer from migraines due to a brain tumor. Art distract me from the pain. I'm sorry you have headaches. Lisa, I hope you feel better. Always. MS is horrible. I'm sorry you're dealing with that, Jennifer. All right, y'all. I'm running out of battery. And we got to clean up the house before we head home. We want to hang out with Miss Judy a little bit more. There's a lot of overspill. Why didn't Miss Judy pour? Uh, we're going to pour with her after we Zoom. So now you just say bye. I said bye.